Happy Monday, happy Monday, Limit Lifters. Good morning. Well, for, oh, it's afternoon. I meant to come on here since this morning, but I was getting some other things done. Um, it's after 12, but happy day. Um, I, I think everybody's on Eastern time, so it should be about the same time for you. But I wanted to, this is a quick hop on, um, just because there's some stuff, something that's um, in my spirit from devotional time this morning that I wanted to share with you. But I also wanted to get your feedback to hear what you think about this thing because I'm still processing it, right? And it is to do with um, faith and obedience. Faith and obedience. You know, we know that we should have faith in God and you know, faith is evidence of things not seen, the things hoped for, things like that. We know that. Um, and obedience, straightforward, right? We should obey, right? Be obedient. But it is to do with when we're praying for something, we're praying for a situation or we're praying for something, we want God to do something. And we pray and we pray believing, right? We pray and we pray believing. Not so easy sometimes, you know, but we should be praying, believing in faith and by faith that God has heard our prayer. And as his word says, he will answer as long as it's according to his will. Now, the thing is, where is your faith? Where is, and when I say you're, like I said, I'm processing this too. Where, if we're to be honest and we check, when we pray, where is the faith? There's so many places our faith can be without us even realizing. Um, is our faith in the power of God to do what we want done? Is our faith in the presence of God to be where we want him to be, to show up? Is our faith in the promise of God? Like he said, you know, um, if you ask in my name, Jesus ask in my name and the Father will grant it. Is our faith there that what are we standing on believing? I know it should be God, but when you think about it, I think I know I've had times when it might have been the promise. Because God promised this, I'm going, you know, I believe. Because he is powerful, I believe. Because, and so my faith is in his power. Because he's present everywhere, somewhere where I can't be or I can't show up, I know God is there and he will take care of whatever. And so like the faith then is in the, in his presence, you know, together with his power. Um... And sometimes I wonder if our faith is in our ability, like what we did, like I prayed and I believed. And so, so is my faith in me, my effort, meaning that it's going to happen because I prayed. And if I didn't pray, it's not going to happen so that my faith is in my effort. And then, what about the obedience part? Should it be my obedience that is, is causing my answers to come? Where does obedience fit in? And I'm just being a teaser. I have my own thoughts and stuff. Because like I said, I was processing it since this morning. Still processing, you know, in our obedience. But I think of how we operate sometimes our faith is in our own presence meaning if i don't show up if i don't i'm not there if i don't say what i want to say if i don't speak to this person things are not going to happen and these things that are to happen is stuff that i prayed about but then i'm still thinking i need to show up and i need to speak and i need to fit to happen so you see that toss up so I would love to, for you to say, um, and like the theme, I wanted to throw this out in the group anyhow, let the, for the theme to the week to be obedience, our obedience. Um, 
my my little thing is that it's my obedience that really should count you know walking in obedience what god said i should do you know obedience to his word and leave the results to him so many times we it's not so easy to leave the results to him we are invested in the outcome and we are invested in the results so when it doesn't happen the way we pray and ask for it to happen we disappointed and it takes us different length of time to recover and to make the shift or to you know accept that so please i would love to hear your thoughts on this how is it for you when you check yourself do a check-in how is it for you where is your faith is it in, in him alone his power his promise his presence is it all of it or something else right but i'd love to hear from you so drop your comment um as soon as you hear this um message right have a blessed day i'm gonna be popping in a little bit more from this week for this week and the theme is obedience i'm gonna be coming with a little more gems and stuff with obedience to help us to be obedient to god so that we can see his promises to us have a blessed day